political profile, former Labour MP for Rochdale. Um, but, but really, the story of the night is, is George Galloway, isn't it? You know, standing next to me now, we'll try and get a word with him any second um, because there's an awful lot to discuss with this one. We believe that every country needs a Labour Party that will represent... Yeah, absolutely. We will stay with you, Peter, on the uh, hope that we will get to hear from George Galloway. On the screen, you can see the share of the vote, 40% of that vote um, and 21% for the independent candidate. That is a huge percentage of the people who came out to vote did vote for George Galloway. The majority is uh, now clear. I've, 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 I've equaled uh, Mr Churchill's record. I saw that in the Times, yes. Yeah, I've equaled Mr Churchill. So, Peter, I think you're going to try and grab a word with Mr Galloway. You can see him George, there. Mr Galloway, the you're not... You're not you're we'll go right. We'll go right. Okay. No. No, so I don't well, many no, congratulations. I think there are others here who would like to talk to you. Thank you for talking to Sky News and many congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. So George Galloway, as you can see, is in great demand. He's, he's been ushered away he's for now. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, but we have been told that we will get a word with him at some point anyway. George Galloway should be said as a long-term critic of the BBC uh, for whatever reasons and has chosen to speak to, to other media organisations. But we do obviously hope to hold him to account, speak to him uh, here in Rochdale this evening as we've spoken to all of the other candidates throughout uh, the night. Um, but yeah, I mean, what a story here uh, unfolding in this...